What up, nerds? We're back with Turok. 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 The Rock. Turok Wong. I was watching yesterday, kind of. Oh, my freaking fuck. Like, in between the queues, I was watching, uh, like, videos of, um, uh, like, old wrestling from, like, 2000. No, like, early 90s. Early. Like, late 90s, early 2000. Uh-huh. Sort of like when The Rock became a thing. And, um, you know, I didn't realize how often he got rocked. Like, The Rock got wrecked by fucking Stone Cold. Yeah. <laughs> like, I mean, there was a whole, <laughs> what are they called? The little story arcs, I guess? Yeah, it was uh, that. Um, that Stone Cold was supposed to be whooping his ass. And then every now and then, uh, The Rock was able to beat him with, like, the Stone Cold stun or whatever. And then that's when, um, Stone Cold started using The Rock bottom on him. There was, like, there was a moment, and I'm not wrong, right? There was a moment where, like, The Rock and Stone Cold teamed up, and it was, like, yeah, yeah, like, like big. Everybody was, times. like, yeah. Because of Triple H, like, taking up the whole thing with, what were they called? The big-ass gang that they had? Yeah, um. Like, it was not the one with Xbox and whatever, like. Wait, the, was it the one with, with, uh, no, so it wasn't, yeah, it wasn't Xbox or it whatever was, like, the, the big one with the McMahons. Is it the one that had? Because recently there was a video up on it, but I can't remember what it was. Is the one that had um, Batista? No. Nah, oh, I think he was a big part of it. Yeah, it was like it was, it was like three twenty of them. of them. It was like twenty of them in that big. Oh, group. I think that was that was after. No, that was yeah. No, that was before Batista. Then yeah, you can save the game. We should have saved the game. Go for it. No controller pack. <laughs> so we can't save, dude. Do I have to keep jumping in the middle? Yo, how do we save actually? Doesn't this have a safe state? Too? I hope so. Yeah, I mean, what's the point of having an emulator if you can't save state? Are you is he shooting lasers at me? It looks like it. Is this 2005? <laughs> you know, 10 years in the future. This is the future thing again. <laughs> like 2005, we got jetpacks, lasers, hover cars, and hoverboards. Did he die? Yeah. Um. Can I get this gun? No, yeah, but I was watching the videos and I'm like, man, The Rock got wrecked by this guy a lot. It was every, like, every other clip was like, <sighs> like Stone Cold would run in and The Rock is like, or The Rock would do that shit where he would run in and crouch really low waiting for, like, Stone Cold to turn yeah. around. And then, like, when Stone Cold turned around, he would try to hit him and he would <laughs> stop him and Stone Cold stun his ass instead. Yeah. <laughs> and then The Rock did that shit where he would fly straight up. Yeah, like, he exaggerated <laughs> yeah. that shit. He rolls over, like, three times. <laughs> yeah, backwards yeah. Backwards flip. I was watching it with Kenny, and Kenny was like, I don't get it. And I'm like, dude, he's stunned. Like, it's the Stone Cold Stunner. He's stunned. Like, he's done. He's out. Oh, my God. I want to keep these for, like, a boss or something. Or, you know, like, another human being. <laughs> Watch him explode. Do you uh, even have to fight? You can literally just run away. I think so. These dinos aren't doing anything. You didn't. You didn't even. You didn't even aim at him. You didn't even aim at him on that one. You shot yeah, at the wall. Quick note, scope. Whoa. Yeah, I watched the thing Michael sent it, um, the Triple H thing. Yeah, that one. Yeah, he was never that good. The it had a wrestler. ton of actors. It had a ton of actors. There was like the kid from Six Sense was in there. Josh Peck from Drake and Josh was in there. Yeah, I noticed him. Uh, fuck, I can't remember the other guys. There were like, YouTube people too, right? I yeah, yeah. I saw the one who was. Chick. The one who was Triple H was uh, Chloe Dijkstra. Dijkstra? I don't know her, but yeah. The, that blonde chick. What's her fucking name? I'm pretty sure it was her. She does like a lot of um, rants. That's her thing. Fuck, I'm trying to remember. Because there were, yeah, there were a ton she of... She was part of Triple H's like little group the, with Mr. Assman and somebody else. I think she was one of those guys. If I remember correctly. Okay, I can't. And the, the funny thing is, like, watching that video, I realized, like, I used to watch wrestling during that time, specifically, when, like, Triple H was a thing. Um, Undertaker was massive. Like, everyone fucking loved The Undertaker. Kane. I mean, that's when it was really entertaining. Like, it was. It was, it was fun to watch. Stone Cold. Uh, as much as you hated him, Triple H brought something there. Um, There was someone else. What? Why did I get them? When she, when the Ooh. video, the guy mentions Ric Flair, I was like, I forgot all about Ric Flair's old ass. Like, yeah. just like he was, he came into WWE a little later, I think. I think he was in the other one. There was also, um, and then fucking Kurt Angle. I Kurt him. Angle, I hated Kurt Angle. Fucking hated him with a burning fiery passion. Chris Jericho was supposed to be annoying, but I liked him from the beginning. He was fun. 
I, I've always told you, like, my favorite were always the Hardy Boys. And they were so no-name. Like, they were no one. Yeah, they were, like, middle, I mean, lightweight or whatever division. They always, like, every time they showed up, it was, like, the two of them. And it was a load of shit. And they always had Lita with them. And nothing nothing good ever came from her. Oh, I think yeah. she ended up, actually, with, like, someone else. Fucking die, dude. I just don't remember who. If I remember, it's probably the Tusk guy. The It was a big guy. I know it was a big guy. Like, a tall guy. Maybe, um, maybe even Kane. I think it was Kane. Oh, it might have been. I, I don't know. Because then after a while, the, the brothers disappeared and she ended up having to like solo everything. Fucking broke their backs from the ladder. Yeah. <laughs> and they always did that shit with their hands, the fingers. Yeah. Like they turned them up. Um, there was something about him no uh remember when this guy showed up like he wasn't a big thing he was he was around but it, then like when he took over it became like a big deal it was uh the one that's still around the the old guy that pretty much runs everything mcmahon yeah mcmahon fuck i forgot like he, he wasn't like he didn't show up like at the, at the start like it was a thing like he came in later and everybody was like like his return or some bullshit yeah, and was like, he took over when triple h uh, was with him like the they took over everything and then uh triple h married the daughter i remember oh, this guy should laser. i remember being excited to watch it but i never believed it was real like or at least like i don't know whether it's real or not it didn't matter the thing that confused me was like like i'm like okay like whatever it, it was always like the the what what interested you was like um m- more like the story than anything else because then like it was fun to watch when when it was supposed to be like behind the scenes you know what i mean yeah, yeah. like they they're like oh we're backstage they're in the locker room. yeah yeah and they're filming and then all of a sudden like some some dude shows up in like a, in a limo dude are you, are you on acid the e, dude. dude you are fucking tripping balls I don't, about visibility, but I don't know where to go with it holy crap you are tripping jesus christ like that's what this game needed was another fucking completely disastrous visual effect Honestly, I have no clue where I'm going. I think it's here. There it is. Yeah. Stop throwing grenades when I'm right next to you. Are you <laughs> fucking like dumb? Um. Yeah. So someone would show up in a limo and they're like, "Oh, you know, I'm just coming, or I'm gonna go home from like a hard day at work." And all of a sudden, someone. Pulls him out of limo, beats his ass, steals the title, and they're like, "Ah, it's mine!" <laughs> they're like, "Oh my god, this was totally unexpected." <laughs> Why the fuck was there a camera there? <laughs> like, why the fuck are you filming this if it was unexpected? I don't understand. Uh, Stone Cold was like the king of the backstage one because he'd go with his big ass truck to run you over. Oh my god, yes. The the there was also um. Did somebody shoot him. There was also. The beers? Oh, yeah. That he always, like, what is it? He always had someone throw him a beer or he had the beers with him? The, the one thing that threw me off was, like, like sure, whatever, call it fake. But then I couldn't understand, like, if it was fake, how the fuck, like, some of them were just bleeding, like, their gory eyes out and shit. Like, Stone Cold, more often than not, ended up with a ton of blood on his face. And I was like, man, did he just get wrecked? <laughs> I still don't know to this day if a lot of that was fake or not. But I always gave him credit because you can't say it was fake when they uh, jumped down from that big ass case, the Helena cell, or whatever. Yeah. The one where you climbed on top and then the Hardy Boys would jump from there all the way to the table. It's true. Now, you can't say that's fake. I'm pretty sure. We they went got to hurt there. we went to like the like um South. What is it? Was it the South Florida con? I don't know what it was called, but we went and I told you about this. We we saw like like the live wrestling matches that they had there. <laughs> And, um, like, it was, it's hype as fuck. It's fun as shit to watch. Like, it's really entertaining. This is not, this is not fun at all. This is not fun. (laughs) This is a disaster. I got full health, though. (laughs) I mean, apparently you have, like, unlimited underwater breathing. Anyway. South Florida Con or some shit like that. And we were, we, we were watching, like, the live, um, wrestling match they had. And, like, call it whatever, it's still pretty, like, I don't know how comfortable or how, like, um, how well it takes the impact, but those, it still hurts to get dropped on that shit, I'm going to assume, like, whether, you know, you're being... Oh, the actual rain? 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that shit hurts. Like, so call it fake, call it whatever. Those people still have to put up with those those bruises, those... Like, I I was watching people get picked up and dropped. Some of them were like... Assault rifle. They did, uh... That's unnecessary. <laughs> like, really, you need an assault rifle against dinosaurs? What are they gonna do? I mean, well, yeah, unless sure do. Do you fight a T-Rex in this at some point? Yeah, 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 I think. That's okay, gonna be I don't know where the fuck I have to go. This motherfucker swims. He's swimming at you. Yeah. I skipped, like, 10 of them. Um... Yeah, they were doing like they were throwing people, dropping them. They'd pick them up and like, uh, they they did like at the end the last thing they did was like a royal rumble type thing, and they would just grab people and like they would toss them out of the ring and they would flip and fucking land hard on the ground. And I was like, all right, look, I know that's legitimately ground. Like, there's there's nothing about that. And then um, you know the main reason they call it fake is because when they punch or hit with the hammer, they put their Hand in the middle. But you still get hurt when you use the... Remember they would use the steps? On the oh, uh, yeah. Metal yeah. steps? You could put your hand in the middle. You're still going to get hurt, man. It's true. Like, uh, some of them you can tell, like, when they kick or when they punch. Like, they, it's preempt- like they know it's coming. So, like, it's so preemptive that you can tell they sort of pull back when oh, they yeah. get hit. But, like, for one of the things that happened when we were watching at the live one was one of the guys legitimately hit the other dude hard. Like, he hit him and the guy sort of, like, he played it off. But the other dude, like, he was taken aback by the fact that his fist actually made contact. <laughs> that he, like, he stalled for a second before, like, he hit him again. And we were all, like, like at least the people I was with, like, in the, in the aisle we were with, we were like, I don't think he meant to do that. <laughs> I don't think he was aiming for that shit. I bet you tried to pin him right away just so you could say, my bad, my bad, my bad. <laughs> uh, let's stop here because that's all the time we have for this episode. All right. Yeah, I'm lost. Oh, there's a checkpoint, so I guess we're going the right way. All right. Later, nerds.